Welcome back to Just Scribble. I am so excited to share this video with you guys. I had originally planned to film this actually last month and I wasn't able to because of work and life and all of the things and I'm really actually glad that that happened because a new product came out since then and so now I get to share that with you in this video as well. But this is a video on the Onion Skin Journal all things onion skin journal. Now this video is actually going to be kind of a two-part video because I wanted to unbox and share with you guys all of the onion skin journal items, kind of show you what they have and what they offer, talk to you a little bit about onion skin paper and do a giveaway. But then I also want to play with onion skin paper with you guys and test out different media on onion skin paper and show you guys how it works. I had mentioned that when I did my very first onion skin journal unboxing. This is the journal that I unboxed. I had mentioned I wanted to do that, but I decided I didn't want to do it in my journal because I didn't want to use up pages in my journal that I was using for my thoughts and feelings and emotions and all of the things to do fun test stuff. So instead I ordered something from their shop that I could use to do that with you guys. But since I'm doing a giveaway, I wanted to kind of separate the videos into two things. So in this video, we are actually going to unbox and share all the things, all of the notebook options, all of the sizes, and then do a giveaway at the end. And then I'll have a second video up where we are actually going to play with the onion skin paper and see how it handles different types of media. So before I get started opening these items, I just did want to talk to you a little bit about onion skin. So this is my onion skin journal. This is the original journal style and size that you that they offered and they still offer this in their shop. It is a hardbacked journal. It is A5 ish size. It's a little bit bigger than an A5 journal. It is 8.75 inches tall by 5.75 inches wide. And it comes in a variety of colors. This is the tan with the black foil. They do have quite a few other ones including red cream, lake blue, a black one that has black foil, and then they also have a traveler's one that has a different print here. It's like a world stamp and it's sort of a forest green color. There's 320 pages in these journals and they have a linen cover on them. They are Smythe sewn, they are made in America, they are made by a third generation bookmaker. And they do come with a little pencil board that's lined on one side and dot grid on the other so that you can stick that under here and you can use it as a guide when you are writing or drawing. Onion skin paper is amazing. It's awesome. I've been using it for years in Traveler's Notebook inserts from Paper Penguin and I was really excited when this company started making journals in the paper. It's just it's just an amazing paper. So it is extremely thin, tissue paper thin. It has a little bit of a slickness to it, but not like glide off your paper with your pen slickness. It handles fountain pen ink beautifully, it actually dries really quickly, and it has the most amazing crinkle sound in it after it's been used. So I'm not gonna show you guys all of my journals, but I'm gonna flip through a couple pages just so you guys can see and hear some of the beautiful crinkle sounds in the journal. So this is my journal and I really love it. There is something so pleasurable about writing on this paper. It's just a joy to write on and I absolutely love the ASMR sound when I flip the pages, when the pages get full. So this is my journal that I had unboxed and I will put a link up above just so you guys can check that out because I did talk a little bit more about the onion skin paper in that video. But in this video I wanted to unbox my second journal, some new items that they came out with that are also in onion skin and also do a giveaway. So I'm gonna scoot my journal aside and we're actually gonna start with these. So these two are the same as my journal, but one of these is for me and one of these is for one of you guys. The onion skin journal graciously donated a notebook to me to do a giveaway for you guys. And so this notebook, which is the beautiful red 
with the red silk ribbon. This is actually going to be the giveaway and I'm going to talk about the giveaway and how to enter at the end of the video, but this is going to go to one of you so that you can have an onion skin journal of your own. But we're going to open up my second one just so that you can kind of see what it's going to look like when you open it up and you can check out another color because I did get an alternate color in my second one. They wrap everything in this beautiful craft paper and then it has a sticker on it. I'm not going to open this one because I want to send it to the winner like that, but I'm going to share mine with you guys. So my second one is actually this beautiful white one with the gold embossing on it and the gold page marker. I think that these two journals go really well together and they sort of complement each other. I actually don't like page markers, so I had cut mine out of this one and I'll probably do the same to this one. When you get your notebook, it will look like this. It will say the onion skin journal down the side. You could definitely add the year or the quarter or the month and do something to put the date on the spine of your journal. You keep them all lined up on your bookshelf so that you can see what time period they relate to. When you open it up, you're gonna get a beautiful bookmark. It does have their Instagram and their website at the bottom. And I'll put all of that down in the description box as well. And then you'll get your pencil board. And then when you and then turn the page, you go into the beautiful onion skin journal. It's gorgeous. I love it. And it does pretty well lay flat. It's not gonna lay completely flat. It lays pretty flat and I have no trouble writing on both sides of the paper. That is the beautiful onion skin journal. So this is my newest one, the white one. And then this is the prize that we'll talk about a little bit more in a little bit, but they offer other items as well. When they first launched their journal, the A5-ish size journal, they also had a stationary set, which I don't own but I will put a link down below so you can check it out for writing some snail mail. But they also had and still have their notepad. And I bought their notepad because this is what we're going to play with to test out all of the media on onion skin paper. I just felt better doing it on a notepad like this versus in my personal journal. So I got this notepad and I'm really actually excited about it. I might have to snag another one because I think that this would be just a really awesome thing to have on my desk in my studio. So when I'm doing pen sampling or swatching, I could just grab it and I could do that with you guys on onion skin paper. But like the journal, it does come with a pencil board so that you can stick that under there as a guide for writing. You can do it with the dot grid side as well. It is the same size as the page that's inside your journal. So you could actually use this, if you wanted to add more pages or add tippins to your journal, you could use this to do that. But also if you use any other A5 notebook, you could take pages out of this and then you could tip them into your A5 notebook. You could also do it for a B6, you would just have to cut the paper down. But it is a notepad of all onion skin paper. And then it has a beautiful cardstock cover on it that has a gorgeous, let's see if that's going to show up, a gorgeous texture on it. It's really nicely made. It's really flexible. It just feels really good in the hand. And I think it is so pretty. It's a good way to test out the onion skin paper. If you don't really want a notebook, one option is to get the notepad. Or if you're just a notepad person and you're not really a journal person, you could definitely get the notepad. So that is the notepad. So we have the original journal. We have the notepad. And then they also launched soft cover here inserts. So these are linen soft cover inserts. They come with 96 pages of blank onion skin paper. They have a linen cover. They are saddle sewn. They are also made in America and they come in a variety of color options and also a variety of sizes. So for colors, they come in the wheat with the black foil, the lake blue with silver foil, charcoal with clear foil, and green with clear foil. And then they come in a variety of sizes. They come in Passport. This is Passport, so we're gonna check that out. They come in A6, they come in B6, which is what this one is, and they come in A5, which is what this one is. So I did not buy A6, I don't use A6 anymore, so I didn't feel the need to purchase that, but I thought we would check these out. So 
that you guys could see these new soft cover options. If you don't like a hardback journal or you use a traveler's notebook, you still wanted to use the beautiful onion skin paper, you could buy one of these Kefir inserts. So this is the passport size. It still comes with the little pencil board, which is awesome and it's so cute. I love passport size. And it is a saddle stitch sewn insert. So you could put this on the elastic of your traveler's notebook and you would have a beautiful insert in onion skin for your traveler's notebook. It has the beautiful linen cover. This is the lake blue. I just think this color is absolutely gorgeous. So I had to buy it and I decided to buy all of mine matching, but now I really want the charcoal. So I'm probably going to buy those as well because I have some ideas in how I want to use these in 2022 in my traveler's notebooks. So I definitely want to get a few more. This is the passport size. And then this is B6 size. Same thing with the pencil board, the saddle stitch, and the 96 pages. And then this is the A5 size. So this is a true A5 size. So this would fit in your leather covers from Chic Sparrow or Sojourner. They would fit in your folios. It would fit in your traveler's notebooks from either company or any company that sells those si these size traveler's notebooks. This is the A5 size. And once again, it has the pencil board in it. This one has the little bookmark. It's just so you can see. That's how much taller the hardback is from this. So the hardback is a little bit narrower, just a smidge, but it's taller. And because of the fact that it's taller and the fact that it has a little lip around the edge, this does not fit in leather folios from Chic Sparrow or Sojourner. I have tried it. You can put them on a traveler's notebook on the elastic, or you can build a folder for them. I actually have a video on how to do that if you wanted to carry it in one of those. I just keep mine loose like this because the cover is just so pretty and I really like it. So I just keep it loose in the hardback, but it will not fit in your folio covers, just as an FYI. So we have the A5-ish notebook. We have the notepad and we have the Kahir inserts. But now we have the thing I am the most smitten about. I am so excited for this. I actually ended up buying two. These are actually a limited edition size. I don't know if they have any on their website. I will say if they don't have something on their website, definitely make sure you sign up for their newsletter because when they restock, the people that get the newsletter find out first. So if you're looking to buy and it's out of, and what you want is out of stock, if you get the newsletter, you have a better chance of snagging one when it restocks. But these are a limited edition size. These are an A4 size notebook. So basically letter size, just a little bit taller than letter size. So letter size, US letter size paper is eight and a half by 11. And the A4 is 8.25 by 11.75. So it is a little bit narrower than letter size and a little bit taller. It is awesome. This is the biggest onion skin journal and they are fabulous. We are going to check them out. Like I said, I did snag two of them because I, I just knew that I was going to love it and I was afraid that I would not be able to get another one. So I decided to grab it while I could. As of the time of filming, they do still have these in stock. These do come in Hunter Moss Green which is this one and this has clear foil. So if you saw, so if you heard when I mentioned earlier, some things come with clear foiling, this is clear foiling. So it's just kind of embossed on there. You can barely see that, which I actually like. I like that a lot with the clear foiling. And then it comes in wheat with black, which is like my original onion skin journal that I first bought. Oops. And then they come with lake blue with silver, which is what this one is and what my Kahir inserts are. So this is really an extra large notebook. It has a hundred pages of blank onion skin paper. It has the linen cover. It is saddle sewn like the Kahir's. It is not Smythe sewn like these notebooks. And you can tell when you look at the spine right there that they're sewn differently. They are made America. And they also come with, there's the little bookmark, the pencil board, a giant full-size pencil board so that you can slip them under here and you can use it to write. 
I am just absolutely in love with this size. It's so much real estate. So if you are a person that likes to art, this is a really good size for art or art journaling. Or if you like to add some ephemera to your journaling pages with your writing, this gives you tons of space to do that and also tons of space to write. So I just really like it. Plus I just think it's so fun. Like it's so big. It just feels so neat to hold it and to look at it. I'm just, I'm just really in love with this size. And like I said, it is saddle stitched. You can see that. And it will pretty much lay flat. It's gonna be a little bit of a bubble on the edge when you're writing in it, but if you kind of smooth your hand, it'll lay pretty well flat when you go to write on it. And of course you can use a clip or something if you're painting or watercoloring. You can use a clip to kind of hold your pages like you do in a lot of your art journals and things like that. But this is their newest extra large size, but it's not gonna be around forever. So if you are intrigued by this size, I would definitely go and check out their shop and get one because you definitely don't want to miss out. I was gonna show you real quick. So this is the A5 and you can see, so A4 is two A5s. So if you lay your A5, if I had two of these, two of them would fit. So it's twice as much as the A5. If you have an A5 insert and you just wanted to kind of see how it would be, if you have an A5 insert handy, if you open it this way, that's how big your page would be. So you can kind of see if that's something you would like to use to have a full page that's that whole length, if that makes sense. But that is my unboxing and my share of basically all things Onion Skin Journal. I love them. So these are the new extra large A4 size notebooks. These are the new or newer, they've been around for a little bit, here inserts that come in passport a6 b6 and a5 this is the notepad which is just an awesome thing to have around especially if you like to do fountain pen testings and things like that and then this is their journal and my first journal and they're the same so that is my little unboxing and share this is my giveaway so like i said the onion skin journal was so gracious and they actually donated this notebook to me to give away to one of you so i'm going to be doing a giveaway of this onion skin journal like i said it is the red one i'll insert a picture right here just so you can kind of see what it looks like but that is the journal that you're going to get it is the a5 ish hard bound journal brand new still wrapped in its paper so all of the details of the giveaway all of the rules are going to be down in the description box below but I am going to open this giveaway up to international, so it is open to everyone, but please be aware that there are a lot of shipping issues going on right now. So if you are international and you do win, I can't control how long it takes for you to get this notebook, but I didn't want to cut anybody out of the giveaway. So I am opening it to international so that anyone and everyone can participate in this giveaway. You do have to be subscribed to my channel and you have to be subscribed to be subscribed because you like my content and you like my videos please don't subscribe just enter the giveaway and then unsubscribe if you do then you won't be eligible in future giveaways on my channel to enter the giveaway you need to comment down below with an emoji onion like this and then you need to tell me what you would use your onion skin journal for if you would use it for art for an art journal, a prayer journal, a regular journal, for your bullet journal, for your everyday carry, whatever it is, what you would use your onion skin journal for. I do know that people may be commenting just in general on the video or have questions about onion skin journal in general. So that's why the giveaway entry needs to have the onion emoji. That way I know that that is your giveaway entry. And then you can still post additional comments and questions outside of the giveaway as well. But that is how you're going to enter the giveaway. The giveaway is going to end at 11.59 p.m. Central Standard Time on November 5th. And I will announce the winner on November 6th here on YouTube. So I'll announce it with a response to your comment to tell you that you're the winner. And I will also announce it in the giveaway tab. So make sure you are checking back on November 6th so that that way you can see if you have won this journal. So that is how the giveaway is gonna work. But please make sure you do read the description box down below for all of the rules and details surrounding the giveaway. But that is my share of the Onion Skin Journal and my giveaway for the Onion Skin Journal. 
do make sure that you are subscribed so you don't miss future videos, including my play with onion skin paper video that's coming up where we are going to test different media and how it works on the onion skin paper and talk through a little bit of tips and tricks for using onion skin paper with fountain pens and things like that. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to comment below. Make sure that you comment below for the giveaway if you want to win this beautiful onion skin journal. And don't forget to just scribble.